Okay, guys, I want to do a little bit of an inbox to show you what I got in the mail today. Actually, it's funny because I had found the package on the floor by the chair where I sit. And my husband says, oh, your package came. And I'm like, what package? I, I forgot that I had ordered something for myself. And I went to go ahead and cut it open. So it's already open. But I'm going to do it anyway and let you guys see. So anyway, here's the package here. And let me cover up my address. But I had bought something from the coldest water bottle. And uh, let me show you what it is. I must say they really packaged this up really, really well. Because when I cut through it, it's kind of thick and it's kind of layered, doubled wrapped or something like that. So I thought this was very, very uh, good the way they wrapped it. So let me try to get it out. Okay, put that on the floor. Okay, this is the coldest water. Actually, it's not a water bottle. It is a premium coffee mug from the coldest water. And what it is is a coffee mug that's supposed to keep your coffee or your tea or any type of uh, beverage hot for up to six, I believe it's six or eight hours long. So hold on, let me get this, get it out. Oh, I think I got it. packaged very very well if you guys are interested i will have the link down in my description box i have bought um three of their coldest water bottles and they come in different sizes different um yeah different sizes and pretty much different shapes different colors they have some wonderful colors um if i can go in the kitchen i may share the you know the water bottle that i have but this is the box that it's in which is cute now this is pink as you can see and i chose pink because i love pink they also had red they had a few colors more like several colors i should say um some type of greenish mint color they had black they had white um i don't know but you guys check out the link please go and look at the link because uh, they have some wonderful water bottles. A lot of YouTubers are using these bottles and the coldest one, it really keeps your your uh, water or your beverage cold uh, probably for like three days. At least it did for mine. If you put ice in the bottle, it would literally keep your water or your cold beverage cold for days. I mean days, okay? At least three days, maybe more. But this is the one for coffee and I just love it. It's so adorable. It says the coldest water and it is insulated. Um, hold on, I have to put the camera down to see if this down here opens up. Okay, no, this part down at the bottom, it doesn't open up because I had to know that before I open it up, let you guys see. This is the top here and I think it has a little part where you can let me look at it first and study it because I'm I'm just opening it up for the first time so I don't really know but yeah that's all it does it opens up to a point where you can sip it through this little slit here it's where you put your mouth right on top of here and then when you finish drinking you just close it up like that so it opens up like that to drink right here and then you close it up super cute and i'm not sure if you can put a i was wondering if you could take this off to put a straw in it you know i don't know but whenever i drink some coffee and if i'm ever doing another vlog i will share it with you guys if it has a straw you know slot to put that in but anyway isn't it cute super cute and it's supposed to keep it hot, so we will see. I'm going to wash it out, and tomorrow morning, I'm going to put my coffee in it. And we're going to see just how long the coffee stays hot. Because normally, when I use my, my regular coffee mugs, I have to keep going 
to the microwave, putting the coffee mug in, oops, putting it in the microwave and microwaving it several, several hundred times, it seems like it. And it just seems like it never stays hot. So we're going to give this a try. So I really hope that it does what it says or I might have to send it back. But anyway, this is really cute. I like it. This is the, uh, let me see, how many ounces is this? I believe this is the 10 ounce, I think. I don't have my glasses on. Yep, there it is. It's flamingo pink color, and it's the 10 ounces. Can you guys see that? The coldest coffee mug. And the reason why they call it the coldest, because that's the name of the company. So this is supposed to be the hottest. So anyway, I just want to share that with you and check out the link and order you the coldest water bottle or the one for the coffee. Okay, here is my tablescape for graduation 2021 for Aaron. Woohoo! I am so, so excited. Here's a little overview of the table before we get into it. Okay, starting on the wall, I have a congrats sign that says, congrats, Brad. And it's hard to say that, I always get tongue twisted. Congrats, Brad. And two balloons. Most of these items that I'm sharing with you are from the Dollar Tree, the sign is, and the balloons. I thought that was really cute. And on the other wall, I have three signs on here. That has the stars. So there's three stars. I have them hanging on the wall like this. There's the cap and gown. I mean the cap, not the gown. But the cap hat. This is so cute. And the other little thing that says Reach for the Stars 2021. So I have three of those hanging on the wall there. And now for the tablescape, for the heads of the table, I have just two balloons. I started to put balloons on every chair, but I thought that it would be too much because there's a lot going on on the table as well. So I didn't want to overpower it with too much. So let me get back so you guys can see it um, in full. So that's how it looks. Now going in, I'm using this foil paper, which is gold yellowish whatever you want to call it uh, Aaron's high school colors is pretty much burgundyish it's like a burgundyish red and yellow goldish color so that's why I chose this gold paper here in the center I'm using my own um, table runner which is very shimmery and most of these items uh, that I said are from the Dollar Tree on top of this nice runner, I have these um, little decorative gems, and that will go for the color of red for his uh, class colors. I also have some paperweights. I have two gold ones, one there. I have a white one in the back. There's the other gold paperweight. Then I'm using two Dollar Tree candles and my own candle holders. On the lower part, I have some candle um, holders, the black ones, one there, and one there, and that's from the Dollar Tree as well. I have a congrats grad sign, so that was cute. And behind it, I'm using my burgundy flowers here with my white base. Uh, that looked nice. Okay, now on to the place settings. I'm using my silver chargers. I have a white dinner plate. I have a Dollar Tree. All of these are Dollar Tree except for uh, the white plate and the chargers. Uh, this is a this is a square paper plate, but I decided to turn it in this direction. And then I'm using my salad plate, my white salad plate, and Dollar Tree's uh, paper plate. And I decided to turn it this way, so it'll give it that type of look. 
I'm using their bowls, their black bowls, which are really cute. I like their bowls. And in each bowl, as you can see, is a diploma that I <laughs> made up. I just took some paper, cut it in half, roll it up, and I didn't have anything really um, fancy to tie it around it, so I just took some old tissue paper that I had just laying around, and I just kind of like made a little tie there, as you can see. So that's how I came up with that. I'm using their Dollar Tree's plastic, um, plastic ware, the spoon, knives, and forks. And they're cute, adorable cups. I love these cups. They're just plastic. It says, congrats. Cute as that. And they're little napkins. I just fold it up and place it in the cup there. And of course, you gotta have some champagne. So we have the champagne glasses there with my um, posters there. And everything is pretty much the same as far as the place setting, except for the two heads. They have something special. Now, I went to Dollar Tree and picked up only one of these cute, adorable hats. You know, I didn't know what I was going to do with it. And then I went back because I wanted five more um, so that I can put them like this. When I went back, you know the deal. They were all gone. <laughs> So I was like, oh my gosh. So I needed five more, but instead I only found one. So that one is over there on the other head. So I just said, well, you know what? Let me just go ahead and put them on these glasses here. And I thought that would be nice for the two heads. That's fine. And I'm using a bling poster for the two heads. And everything else is pretty much the same. And this is how I styled it out. This tablescape has been helpful to you and giving you some ideas on how to style your graduate a tablescape. Please give me a big thumbs up. Give me a comment and subscribe to the channel if you haven't already done so. I welcome you so much for joining Jazzy Green Decor Style family. I can also be reached on other social media, Instagram at Jazzy Green Decor Style. You can reach me there. And I want to thank you guys so much for watching. You guys have a blessed day. And congratulations to all the 2021 graduates. Woohoo! Congratulations, Aaron, my little grad. <laughs> guys, take care. Be blessed. And I will see you next time in my next video. Bye bye.